You're watching CBS 2 News in high definition. Good evening, I'm Don Daler. We begin with a developing story. President Obama, just moments ago, spoke out for the first time about a Secret Service scandal involving prostitutes. The scandal has overshadowed his trip to Latin America. Now President Obama is addressing the embarrassing incident, and CBS 2's Dave Carlin joins us with what he said. Dave. With President Obama at the Summit of the Americas, this scandal is proving to be an uncomfortable distraction. He promises a fact-finding mission and disciplinary action, but others say Congress must get involved immediately. I expect that investigation to be thorough, and I expect it to be rigorous. President Obama now forced to deal with the biggest scandal to ever hit the agency responsible for protecting him. I expect us to observe the highest standards. Coverage of his diplomatic mission to Latin America is overshadowed by the 11 agents who were removed and placed on leave amid allegations of wild partying and contact with prostitutes in secure zone sections of this hotel. Congressman Darrell Issa, chair of the House Oversight and Government Reform Committee, said the Secret Service may need to be fully investigated and transformed. It'll be about how did this happen and how often has this happened before. Things like this don't happen once if they didn't happen before. Uh, I don't want the entire Secret Service to be tarnished by what 11 people appear to do. New York Congressman Peter King, chairman of the House Homeland Security Committee, explained why he is very troubled by the reports that agents brought women, including at least one suspect, prostitute into this hotel in advance of the president's visit. One of those prostitutes could have been paid by the terrorists infiltrate. They could be overhearing what's going on. Uh, they'd be inside that zone. It's just it's irresponsible. Congressman King said anyone visiting the hotel overnight was required to leave identification at the front desk and leave by 7 a.m. When one woman failed to do so, hotel staff investigated and found the woman with the agent in the hotel room allegedly arguing over payment. That agent and the others were sent home and replaced. I don't know how this happened, and let's hope it's just a single aberration. I'll wait until the full investigation is completed before uh, I pass final judgment. And this scandal expanded to the U.S. military, which announced five service members may have also been involved in misconduct. President Obama is scheduled to leave uh, Columbia and return to the U.S. tonight. Don. All right, Dave, thank you. And stay with CBS2 and CBSNewYork.com as developments unfold in the Secret Service scandal. Now to breaking news on Long Island. A small plane is for...